Do you know anything about the girl? I just know that she has a sweet ass. My boy. Hey, long time no see. <laughs> Berlizzi. <laughs> oh! What is going on to all of my goats out here, guys? We are here playing the final pin. Now I'm here playing this game because apparently your boy Berlizzi is in this game. And you know I'm headed right for them breasts. Breasts when I. Hey, we never talked about Berlizzi on the channel, but you know, hey, like this dude, hey, like of course, no, everybody knows Berlizzi. Now, I'm very sorry, guys. I I don't have my own pair of easy gang glasses. But, but, actually, you know what? Yes, I do have my own pair, and it's right here. Oh, yeah. I am ready to go. Always, guys, remember to subscribe. Discord is linked in the description so you can get a early access on when all my content is going to be out. Let's go. Oh, perfect timing. You hear the, the music again? That was perfect timing. Serial killers are not monsters looking in the shadows, but human beings living among us, hiding in plain sight. They are the embodiment of our darkest fears and most twisted desires, reminding us that the line between good and evil is often razor thin. I'm not going to lie to you. None of that just went through my head. It just went like... Nineteen sixty-eight. The classic music. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, this looks nice. Okay, I see you. All right, seems that we're in a house right now. Can I open anything? Bedroom. Kevin's room. Oh, hello. Oh, actually, they look kind of creepy from afar. What, especially him. What is going on? All right, respect. I like games like these. You already know your boy loves games like these. Excited What's up? for your first day? Yes, I am excited for my first day. Yeah, I hope I can make a good You'll first do impression. Great, Dad. Thanks, Kevin. You have a small head. Thanks, buddy. Good Thanks, buddy. Me. Thank you, uh, Linda. Let me give you a kiss. Mwah, mwah. Yeah, Kevin. Um, we gotta we gotta talk about you know. <laughs> All right, let's go. Where are we going? Um, the back black screen. We shut the door behind us. One month later. All right. Well, I mean, I'm assuming we got the job. Okay, the design of the lights looks sick. Oh my gosh, what on earth happened over here? Oh wow, uh, enter crime scene. Oh my gosh, what is going on? Oh hey, you're new, right? Yeah, I am. Yeah, this is the first time I've ever I've been at. Oh, well then. That means you and I will be crime scene partners for God knows how long. That's a body? Oh, cool. Anyways, you arrived just in time. This was one weird crime scene. Okay, but I did not expect any swearing in this game. His body was rolled over. It revealed this strange symbol. What I haven't symbol? seen anything like it before. I think it could mean something. We'll get my camera from the car. We need a photo of this. Sure, man. Okay, so is this your car? Damn, that's a big camera. Right click for camera mode. Ooh, can I zoom in? No? I'm gonna take a picture of you, Tony. Yeah. Smile. All right, let's take a picture of this body. Oh my God, this is a freaking body? What? Murder begins where self-defense ends. Huh, so we're in 1981. Created by Jordan Lin Lindgren. I hope I'm spelling that right, or saying that right. Shout out to Jordan Lindgren, guys. Check out this game, we're gonna put a link in the description if you want to play this game for yourself, it's completely free. Which is awesome. Oh, 
Okay, so it's uh, what is this? Um, twenty twenty four a.m. There, detective. Some of your partners twenty need help huh? In the apartment building on Ash Street. The guy should be waiting for you in apartment room three one one with some insight on the situation. Over. Got you, bro. Roger that. Let's go. All right, we're running. Why am I still finishing this accent? I should get in my car. Oh, all right, bad. I thought I was gonna run in. I thought we were already here. Question though, can we drive? That's the question. Can we drive? Oh, buddy, I love this game already. All right, where are we going? Where are we going? I don't know. I don't know where our destination is, but we're just gonna go where the road takes us. Oh, bro, we got a checkpoint right there. Okay, that's pretty sick. That's pretty sick, and I just spit all over my screen. Okay, I like this vibe. We got a little destination. Dang, this this place must be huge then. That was everyone's day. Hope everyone's day is going great. People are going back to school. My, uh, you know, my UC Davis is actually starting next month. Yeah, literally, I, I start actually very, very late. <laughs> We're almost here, guys. We're just about here in this area. Very, very nice ambiency. Park here. Right, let me try to park very expertly. Hey, all right, let's go. So I think uh, our apartment number was three one one. Let's enter the building. All right, we got to enter three one one. Okay, let's go in the elevator. So we're supposed to go to floor... I mean... I... Mm, fine. Let's go to 301 to 312. Alright. 311 should be right over here. Hello? Oh my... Thanks for getting here so quickly. <laughs> Why did that actually scare me? We have a little crime scene situation in here. The only one who had noticed anything unusual during the suspected time of the crime is the neighbor one floor below. Apartment room 211. Okay. I just need you to go down there and try to get as much information as possible from the lady. I got gotcha. you. here afterwards and we'll leave you alone to photograph some evidence. Got gotcha, you, my boy. Just saying, bro. Oh. Uh, <laughs> okay. Thank you, Carlos. <laughs> Oh my god. It's so funny because people actually be like that in real life. Like, that's not inaccurate. People be like that, and it's so funny. Alright, guys, we're gonna expect the. Uh, as in Carlos says, we're gonna expect a. Son of a. Excuse me, 211. Hello? Is anyone there? Uh, it's the police, Margaret. I'm with the police. I just have some questions for you, if that's alright. Make it quick! I'm busy cutting my toenails! Judging from your face, your nails probably are crusty. Uh, Why am I gonna... What happened? Do you know what happened in apartment 311? Oh yeah, some lad was stand by his girlfriend because he wanted to break up. Wow. How did you... How do you I know this? I that bastard deserved it. Oh, okay. Disgraceful heavy metal at max volume. My ears are too delicate for that. All right. Um. Okay. What would the police ask? Um. Did you know anything about the girl? Do you know anything about the girl? No. I just know that she has a sweet ass. Oh hell no! What game are we playing now? I'm. I did not expect this. Did you know this man? Oh, I sure did. I'm smoking the devil's lettuce with my grandson once. Oh. Lucky that I'm old. Otherwise, I would have given that stoner the old stone to the cranium myself. Okay. <laughs> All right. How old was he? He was 23 years old. But he stank like an 87 year old for sure. All right. I'm done talking to you. All right. That's all the questions I have for you. That's Thank all. you. You know what? Open me that drawer. I'm about to cut your toenails. My soul. My gun. Carlos. Crime scenes scare me sometimes. Hey, crime scenes can be scary, I will admit that. We've never been in one, but I can't imagine. Photograph evidence. Okay, guys, let's find some evidence. Let's go in the bathroom. Oh my gosh! Is that a- Oh, I thought that was a head for a second. That's a- 
That's the mask. Okay. Um. Inspect the toilet. To this toilet has not been flushed. Um, that is disgusting. But let's keep looking around. That is the most creepy painting I have ever seen in my life. I see some. Uh, is that an evidence over here? Oh, it's the murder weapon. And they left it just sitting there. They did not care whatsoever. All right. Um, that's number two. Oh, we got a handprint. That's a handprint. Take a picture of that. What does that say? Victim's blood handprint. All right. Well, the killer did not care about being caught. But hey, guys, we got some evidence in here. Thanks for the help. Got you, you, bro. Report what you found involving this crime at another time. Sure. It's not that big of a priority right now. Anyways, go home and get some rest, my man. You deserve it. You know what, Tony? You're a cool guy. You too, Carlos. I like your hat. All right, back to the reception. Let's go. Okay. Well, we're gonna go back. Another good, another good day's work. Okay, now, I don't know if there's something supposed to be weird now. Dang, how short are we? How big? Is this chair is as tall as me. All right, looks like we're going back home. Dang, it is late. All right, let's go. Honey, I'm home. Let's go back in. Why? Why is it so dark? Honey? Are you... Are you sleeping? Can I check all the drawers? No? Kevin's room. Bedroom. Alright, let's enter the bedroom. So every room we go in, it's like, it loads. Uh, where's my wife? Hello? Where's my wife at? <gasps> I miss sleeping next to her. No, bro, did she die? No way. Bro. No, now I feel bad. Nineteen sixty-three. What is this? Eighteen. This is eighteen years ago. Oh yeah, it's my wife. Oh hey, honey. Hi. You came just in time. I, I did. think little old Kevin is a tad bit hungry. Go give him his bottle, will ya? Sure. Oh yeah, Kevin is in my age right now. In the nineteen eighty-one, he's an adult already. He's eighteen, about eighteen. Kevin. Hey, Kevin. Here's your bottle. Let me feed you. There we go. Oh! Um. Is that a nightmare? Time. Wake the f up, detective. Tony apparently needs some help ASAP. He okay. Need it, but I don't make the rules here. He's waiting for you on the side of the road by Pebble Lane. Over. All right, jeez, relax. Did one of my cokes fell? There was two cokes, or was there one? I don't even remember. Tuesday, six nineteen a.m. Oh, well, there he is, sir. You're kind of blocking the road. That's not. That's not good. Tony, is everything okay? All right. So this is what went down. Some mother's kid went missing when chasing her dog, who was apparently chasing a crow. What? According to the mother, the dog went as far as to run into a sewer entrance to catch up to the crow. Bro. So our guess is that the kid also went in there and got lost in the tunnels. Oh my I think gosh. You know what you need to do. Why don't you do it, Tony? You were already here. I could have been the backup. 
You just could have got in there like a long time ago. Oh lord. Now, if this is a kid that's missing, wouldn't there be way more cops to handle this? Instead of just two cops? Like, this is an important job. A kid is missing inside of a sewer. I thought, like, ten cops would be trying to look for this kid. I mean, it is his fault he got in here, but at the same time, I mean, it's still a kid. Flashlight. Do we have a limited sprint, though? Do we run out of sprint? Because if we didn't run out of sprint, that would be amazing. I keep forgetting how a sewer would smell. Like, there's so many games about the sewer, but, like, you never wonder how bad it smells in here. Hello, little kid? We are here to save you. We're the police. A strange hole. Hello? Can't see anything. Okay. Okay, we're get it's getting kind of dark in here now. And it got quiet. It got kind of quiet. Um. Oh, it's getting pitch black. Okay. Okay, we're going to the point of no return. Hey, call up Tony on the radio. I'm going to need some backup. We're going to need the SWAT team. There you go. I was like, I was running here for like 20 seconds. Oh! The, oh, the line of escape! Where is he? Sir! Hey! Sir! Hello? Oh my gosh, where is he going? Where is he? He ran this way. Where, where is he? Alright, we're gonna keep running this way. We're gonna keep running this way. Let's go. Come on, he shouldn't have ran that far. Oh. What have I done wrong, officer? Well, I mean, you, you you ran from me, and that's already a suspicion number one. What the heck are you doing down here? I live here. Oh. Alright. Have you by any chance met anyone else down here? A young girl? And hopefully with a the dog as well? Dog. I haven't yes. seen any girl, but I can occasionally hear a dog barking in these tunnels. Where can I find this dog? Well, speak of the devil. Oh, I must have the, the dog. I don't hear any barking. The, dog, right. the dog must have barked. I, I get it now. I know that the dog sure as hell responds to whistles. If you track down where the sound comes from by whistling, you might find the right path to the kid you're talking about. All right, then. I won't handcuff you since I feel bad for you. Oh, yeah. Can I go through this? Snip chain links. Yep. Snip it. Bill, take care of yourself, okay? Oh, my. Oh, I didn't... Oh! Does Bro have no eyes? All right. Doggo! Okay, that was right. That was right. That was this way. Hello? We are here to save you. If anyone can hear me, please respond. Where do I go? That's left. That's this way. That's this way. Oh, I heard the crow. I heard the crow. That's this way. Sir, we come in peace. What the? Hello? Oh my gosh! Why is this scaring me? Uh, turn it. Oh, this is easy. Light work! Light work! There you go. Let's do this now. Wait, but what valve I have to turn? Do I have to turn all four? Boom. Boom. Let's go. Boom. Boom. 
There we go. Okay. Yeah, it's, it should be straight. It should be right on the... Oh. I'm gonna guess this is ketchup. Wait, what? Why did my ear go to the right? Oh my gosh, what is happening? Wait, what? How is it? It's to my right. Guys, I recommend putting headphones on. It's actually a pretty nice experience. Something smells weird. I mean, to be fair, we're in a sewer, so there's no surprise. Hurry to the exit. What? Where is the exit? Oh my gosh, what's that? What is happening? Oh my gosh, gas? Gas? Bro. 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 What about the dog? Oh my freaking gosh. Snip it. Snip it. Snip it. Snip it. Snip it. We're gonna freaking die. We are gonna die. Snip. Snip. Come on, let's go. 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 Let's go.
I want you and Kevin to feel safe and protected. If you say so. Respect. Is he about to wake up and have another nightmare? Hello? Whoa. What's going on? Come in, detective. Oh. Team Carlos are waiting for you by the sandy short beach for some kind of examination. Hmm. Tony's honestly weirding me out a bit. He could just do it himself, but he's been making you do his work for a while now. Well, that's a I good point. Head over there. Now. Over. Fire Tony! Now that I think about it, this whole time Tony has been doing all, like, I, he's been making me do all the work. I'm barely realizing that right now. Wednesday, 7.34. All right, Tony. Double shenanigans are you going to tell me to do this time? You're uh, not Tony. You're the swimmer guy the cops have talked about. Yeah. Swimmer yeah, guy. You're here to dive and retrieve some stuff underwater, right? What? No. This is new information. Well, that's your job to figure out. Look, I don't know what you're doing here, but somebody's got to get the body out of there. And there apparently There's a body in there? Specifically you. Ask your buddies what's going on. They're waiting for you on the bridge. Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to do that. Tony, my boy. You're not going to make me just swim underwater and find a body? Tony. All right, look. Don't get mad at me, but I called you over here to do more than just to gather some evidence. Bro. What are you going to do? I'll explain more when we're there. Oh, hop in. Yeah, you know, let me go with Carlos. Carlos, you're the cool guy. Let me enter with you. Hey, Tony. Last one to the car seat pays for lunch. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um. All right, so the diving squad was busy, and we need someone to retrieve a body. You can't just tell a random cop to do that. It, so that's why I called you. Oh my god. I'm terrified that's why of I diving. I'm trick you into coming here. Just follow the rope and everything will be alright. I've got your swimming gear right here! Okay, Carlos, my god. Why is he saying so mad? I've got your swimming gear right here! Fine. Yes, yeah, actually, we're thinking the same thing. Let's, let's go, I guess. We're gonna die. We're gonna risk our lives just because two other people didn't want to do it. Hooray! Oh my lord. Follow the rope. Oh. Whoa, that... This is creepy. What? Okay, this is kind of cool. Hold and release. Inhale, exhale. Breathe slowly to stay in conscious. Okay, breathe slow. There you go. In. Out. There you go. There you go. One more time. There you go. Okay. I gotta breathe while also doing this? How do you do this? Oh, there you go. Unscrew. I gotta breathe? <laughs> This is like a weird multitasking. I have to unscrew this while breathing, left clicking and right clicking. There you go. Breathe in, breathe out. You got this. There you go. Oh my gosh. Why is there a body in a casket? Activate the lifting bag. Press space to activate. Spam. Oh, spam it. Ah! Spamming. There you go. There you go. All right. So we're not going to ask why there's a body in a casket underwater.
We're just we're just not gonna talk about that. Oh, that's a stinker. Yeah, and I was down there, my guy. Take body oh, out of body God, bag. That's gross. Have a look at the body. Maybe he had something on him. Okay. Bro's face is all deformed. Whew, I'm thirsty now. Um, Carlos, this is not the time. Oh, he had a gun. That's weird. Okay. What else did he have? Oh, man. Is this his ID? What is this? I knew I recognized him from somewhere. Who is he? That's Connor F Geller. Is... Is that second word his middle name, or...? He only lived a few meters from the beach. Oh. You should go and have a peek around his house for any pointers to the situation. All right. Carlos can take you back to the shore. Okay, Tony... What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Stay here and just chill with the body? Have fun with that, bro. You lazy piece of piece of work. I'm gonna take you for a ride. Let's go, Carlos. Let's get it. Is that Carlos's laugh? Like, <laughs> what kind of laugh is that? All right, are we? Is this is this our house? Oh no no, this is I'm sorry. This is Troy's house. Did I say Troy? Connor. Connor's house. Maybe I can find something in the area that I can use to get over the gate. Well, this is completely illegal, but you can climb over this. No problem. Oh, there's a ladder right there. Excuse me, sir. I'm going to need to borrow this ladder in terms of the law. I need to borrow this ladder, please. Thank you. Put the ladder up here. Where do we put it at? Where? Huh? Add ladder. There you go. Climb the ladder. Let's go. This music, though. Oh, my gosh. Uh, excuse me. Ooh, a code. 0529, is that what it said? 0529. Unlocked. Okay. Easy. Let's go. The door is locked. Maybe I can find... Oh. There you go. Now you unlock it and enter. Oh, jeez. Turn the power on. Oh, my lord. All right. We're going to the basement. Do I have my flashlight on me? No flashlight? Hello? We got some more cat food. Um... Oh, here's the power box. I expect a jump scare, guys, so be ready. What the? Oh, okay, this looks hard, but it's not. It's not that hard. Uh, hold on. Okay, like this. Like that. And then like this. Like this. Like this. Like that. There you go. Easy, light work. Let's go. W. Okay. Um, I can't sprint in here. Hello? Um, anyone here? Anywhere at all. This house is like, has nothing. It's abandoned. Read. I'm meeting him by the bridge tonight. He's been stalking me, leaving notes Whoa. by the door, yet I've never seen his face. I don't know what he wants from us, but I'm bringing my gun just in case. Oh! If I don't come back home, just remember, I love you, Sarah. Oh, he did! His son lives in a trailer park not too far from here. I should head over there and see if I can talk to him about this. Who was he meeting? Oh, he was meeting somebody shady. Never seen his face? Take photos inside the house. There's a freaking fly. There's a fly in my room. I mean, what do we take a picture of? The note was a piece of evidence. Is the bed a piece of evidence? Okay. What else is piece of evidence? 
I mean, is it any photo that I can take? I mean, this, the, like, this is all abandoned. This could be a photo. All of this is abandoned. There you go. And then take a picture of the basement door. Basement, hallway. Take a picture of the basement. There you go. All right. So we're good to go. I'm out of here. Let's get out of here. Leave the house. Later that day. Wednesday. Okay. 21-22. What is this, like 9? 9, 9 about 9 p.m.? Okay, we're driving. Are we going to his son? It doesn't give us any waypoints, so we're just driving down the road. Hello, is anybody out here? I hope not. I like the driving part. Like, you, you, you get to drive for a while. They must have built this, like, this is a huge map. You don't only drive for only five seconds. So this is pretty nice. I dig this. Dang, I am gonna admit that we have been driving for a while. Hello? Am I missing anything? Oh, here we are. Here we go. Here we are. Is this the bridge? No, 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 this is the wrong bridge. No, 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 no. This is a different bridge. There we go. Park the car. His son lives way out here? Well, this, this thing isn't going away. Get out of here. I keep seeing it, like, in the corner of my eye, flying everywhere. Hello? Anybody here? The police? No one is inside? How do you know that? They can just not, just respond, just not talk. It's empty. It's empty. 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 Oh! Drill. Okay, we found a drill. Okay. Anybody in this premises? This is the police, guys. Oh. Okay. So, are we gonna go to the next one? This one leaves, seems locked, like shut. Hello? I should be able to disassemble the gate with something. The drill. Get the drill. Get the drill. There you go. Alright, let's go. Hello? Somebody crying in there. Hello? Hello? Drill this. Drill. Ma'am, we're coming! The police is here! Oh, that is not a girl. That is a freaking TV. Search. Lockpick found. Awesome. Nope. Nope. Alright, there's nothing. Why is this turned on and it's static and it's a girl crying? Hex knock. Get out of here. Found a lockpick, though. Okay, that one's boarded shut. There's other- there's two other ones, though. It's over here. Inspect. No one has sat here for a long time. Does it say holiday on it? Hello? Open. Ooh, a key! Give me that, please, thank you. Let's knock on this. Ah, there you go, okay, we already got the key anyway. No one is inside. No one is anywhere. Nothing here. Nothing there. And nothing there. Oh, we need a code? Alright, we need a code somewhere. We gotta find a code somewhere. Okay. No one's in this house. Let's get out. Is someone in this house? Hello? The door is locked. Dang. I don't have a key this time. Wait, I have a lockpick. Can I use the lockpick instead? Yeah! <laughs> Let's go! Oh, wait, what? Oh. Okay, no. No. Yes! Let's go! Alright, we're in here. Hello? That means, that means there's someone in here? Hiding? Are you hiding one of these cabinets? Oh, there's a note. Gotcha. 
All right, what's in this note? What's this? Hey, Billy. Guess what? I've been tinkering with our weapon safe, and I got something exciting to share with you. Drum roll, please. The new code is three one one seven. Why hey. do this? Because leaving the code is one two three four was a dumb move, Billy. <laughs> that was a dumb move. I'm assuming, I'm guessing, on the top of my head, that the weapon is a axe, an axe, because the other, the other van is covered in boards. So I'm assuming that we gotta break it down with some sort of sharp object. Oh, a crowbar and a sniper? Take the sniper! Oh my god, I just spit. Oh my god. <laughs> that is embarrassing. I am passionate about taking that sniper. <laughs> what is wrong with me today? Okay, now the thing is, though, the music stopped, which is worrying me, but. Into the caravan. Hello? Oh my gosh. Um, turn on the light. Oh! It's the crow! It's the crow! It is the crow symbol! Oh my gosh! Bro was chopped! He got some long legs, bruh! Photograph this now! Oh my gosh! That is awful. Your obsession for him grows stronger. Dang, bro has the time to make a whole crow. Someone got murdered! Get out of here! We gotta leave! Whoa, drive home. Oh my goodness, dude. All right, I guess we're driving home then. All right, let's go home. Oh my gosh, dude, that is terrifying. You gotta call Tony, you gotta call everybody, bro. Someone was literally chopped everywhere. Like, you, it, it's, it's serious, it's becoming a serious thing now. We have to stop them. We have to stop the guy with the crow. Who is it? Bro, watch it, bro, it's gonna be a twist. Watch it be like Tony. I just wanna bet Tony's actually the killer since he hasn't been doing anything. So he can cover up his work. He don't want to discover his own issues. That's gonna be the twist of the game. All right, let's go. Sleep on the sofa. Why not on my bed? Why not on my bed? And where's Kevin? It still says his room. Sit on the sofa. Is it memory about a flashback? I have that feeling a memory's gonna flashback. We're sitting. We're sleeping on the couch today, I guess. 1978. Three years before the present day. Three years. This is the fifth time this week you've done this sh What'd I do? We're literally begging you to stay. What's happening? I barely even see you nowadays. Oh, snap. I have my reasons? Oh. No! Don't say that, me! I'm this close to solving the crow killer clay. Clay! Is your job really that more important than your f***ing family? <sighs> I don't even know what to say. To do with your job anymore. You're doing this in your f***ing spare time. Every. Single. Day. You two wouldn't understand. No, this is bad communication 101. No. Yeah. You still don't care. <sighs> Bro, we're a terrible I can't person. Take this anymore. Oh, they left me. They didn't die, they left me. You, Dad. Yo! Bro, they didn't die. They left me. I mean, I deserve it. Like, literally, I don't know why you would say that to your wife and kid, bro. Never say that to your wife and kid, bro. You two wouldn't hey, understand. Detective. Oh my uh, gosh. I'm sorry to tell you this, but I, I just got a report from Carlos's husband. What? Carlos. Carlos is Carlos dead. Carlos has been killed. Oh uh, my god. Husband in the interrogation room by the police station. 
Carlos is dead? No, my boy Carlos. How could they do this to my boy Carlos? Are you serious right now? What? Dang, bro. Here I thought that my life was crumbling because of because I thought my parents passed, like my my wife passed away. Bro, they literally left me, bro. And why is the police department door open? How many police are in this town? Two? Three? Oh my god, it was freaking Tony. Guys, guys, Tony is the culprit. I can already sense it. Tony is the freaking culprit right now. Tony is the culprit. Hello? Who's in these stalls? Sink. Oh. Someone. Okay. I'm starting to wonder why, how, how good this police department is. I feel like I'm starting to doubt their authority. Oh my gosh, what is going on? Where is the chief at? Talk to him on the walkie-talkie. Where is he? Was it saying enter investigation room? Is that what it said? Is this Tony? Tony? Wait, who is this? Is that Tony? Hey. Wait, no, this is a random guy. Hey there. Look, I know what has just happened is difficult for you to process, right? Oh, this is Carlos's husband. I'm tripping. I Carlos's husband. So much. I do too. I'm just gonna ask you a couple questions. I won't take up too much of your time. Sounds good. How long were you and Carlos we were together? Together for 14 years. Wow, that is a lot of time. Jesus. Two years old. Since 18 years old, you've been with this guy? Oh my, my gosh. Name is Dylan Lewis. All right. Now I have some personal questions for you. I need you to answer these questions as detailed as possible. How was your relationship with Carlos? Oh, it was... It was just great. What's happening? Are we gonna get another flashback? Flashback time! Seven points out of nine. Not too savvy, Carlos. Beginner's luck. Let's oh. see if you can beat his score. Okay. Oh, I'm about to beat his score. Watch this. Bang. Okay, I got this, bruh. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Woo! Perfect score! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Let's go! Sorry, Carlos. Yeah! Sorry, I apologize. I'm sorry. We sure had some good times together. Wow. Did Carlos ever feel unsafe in his line of work? I mean, he's a police officer, so of course you'd feel unsafe no, at times. Not at all. I'd say it was the perfect fit for him. Got another memory. Oh, we're at a restaurant. How was outside. his day at work? I remember him being specifically excited when you started working there. My day's oh. been exciting! Yeah, Another has started working with us. He's a detective, and if we're yes, lucky, me. he might work with me and Tony. I Carlos can't is cool. wait to get to know him. You know what? Carlos is a cool guy. It's Tony I don't like. I'm meeting a watermelon. You loved meeting new people. Did your husband have any enemies? Not at all. I'd say the opposite. It's Tony, bro. I already know it. I already know it's Tony. Tony is the killer. He is the crow killer. This whole time. Tony is the crow killer. 
Oh, it's the homeless guy, Bill. Got any spare change? It's freezing out here. I think you need something more than just spare change. Take my jacket. I don't want you to be cold. God, God bless you, sir. Carlos, you good man, bro. Carlos, dang, Carlos, such a good guy. He was such a kind man. <sighs> man, that breaks my heart. What happened to Carlos? That's not what I. That's not what I just asked. What moments do you remember leading up to Carlos' Here's death? What I can recall. All right. I don't know what happened. Oh my God, he's gonna be with Tony. He's gonna be with Tony, and he's gonna die. Oh my gosh. Oh my lord. I remember him coming home very late one day. Come in. Oh, I'm playing. <laughs> I didn't even know what I was playing. Open the door. You're home late. What's up, Carlos? We just got some good news involving some crow killer case. Oh? I got some new evidence involving the case I've been talking about. Oh my god, guys, guys, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, guys, oh my gosh, guys, guys, I already know the whole plot right now. I have no whole plot. Carlos found some new evidence about the crow killer. And I feel like the evidence that he's gonna get, it's gonna expose Tony, and it's gonna uncover that Tony is the crow killer. Tony figured this out, that he found evidence that can get him in jail forever, so he killed Carlos. To keep his mouth shut. I'm predicting this whole line right now. I thought he might now. be able to solve the case with this evidence. Ooh, he's about to, ooh, I already know what's about to happen. He came home even later. Okay. Guys, if I predict this whole freaking, like, this whole story, I swear. Hey. He's a, he looks sad. He looks sad. this time he told me that he was scared. Like someone was watching him. Oh? What's wrong? I think I'm being followed by someone. Oh, no. The day after that, he... He didn't come home at all. Oh my gosh, Tony got the hold of him, bruh. He's gonna look out the door and no one's gonna be there. Oh my god. Carlos! Carlos! Bro. We're outside right now looking for him. Where are we gonna go? I don't know where to go. The alleyway? Oh, he's gonna find him in the dumpster. Oh. Dead. Oh my gosh. I still can't get that crow symbol out of my head. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. You said something about some evidence that he had found? Yeah, oh my gosh. He, he found some big evidence apparently. I don't know much about it, but I do know that some scientists are trying to confiscate the evidence or something. Bro. Well, Dylan, that's all the questions I had for you today. Oh my god, guys. God, guys. It's Tony, bro. It's Tony. It's Tony. It's Tony. Thank you for your time. Bro, give me a hug, man. Just 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 come here. Just just bring it in. Oh my gosh, guys, Please, guys. If you find this person, kill him. Ooh. Ooh. I gotta lie, bro. If someone killed my like my wife of 14 years, bruh, I wouldn't blame him for thinking like that. I need a drink. Oh my gosh, guys. We're about to oh my god. I'm still I'm still clinging on to Tony being the killer. Be beer Leezy? <laughs> I wonder who can own this place. I wonder. Hello? Oh, that's a lit. This is beer? Oh my gosh, nothing but beer. Oh my god. <laughs> is this Burleasy? Easy gang. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. My boy, Burleasy. My boy. Hey, long time no see. 
<laughs> What's up, bro? What can I get for you today, my man? The usual? Low-key, some good voice acting. Oh, I'm down. Can I just get some sure. alcohol? How much do you need? Give me as much as you're allowed to get. Oh my god, bro, we're depressed. Damn. You throwing a party, bro? Nah, just for me, bro. Oh. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. <laughs> Loki's putting effort in the voice acting. I kinda I I dig this. Choose your amount of payment. 16 bottles of um, what if I just put one dollar? <laughs> one dollar. <laughs> Not how about how about ten dollars? Ten dollars? Yeah, but how about zero dollars? Zero dollars. Oh, I have to put eighty, huh? Here you go. Yeah. Thanks, Berlin. I'll see you around. Of course, bruh. You spot a chick with some smooth skin? Call your brother Berlin. <laughs> <laughs> that is so funny. Thank you, my boy. I appreciate you so much. You have a good day and get that easy gang up. Let's go. All right, we're out of here. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I was wondering, I was like, where is he at? Like, I've been playing for like an hour and I was wondering where this guy was at. Oh man, so we just bought a lot of alcohol for ourselves. And it's the freaking crow again. Every time. That crow just passes by here. Bro, we're about to get hunted right now. The crow killer's about to come for us now. Now, what evidence? I'm curious of what evidence Carlos found. That's like big. Sit down on this sofa. I don't know why. I have a bad feeling something bad is about to happen. But anyway, I'm gonna sit on the sofa then. Sit down. Sit down with our alcohol. Oh, man. Cope. No, don't do this. Oh, oh, I don't want to do this. I don't want to. I don't want to do this, bruh. Why? Why are we doing this? Oh, this is a bad choice. Oh, God, what's happening? You ignored their intervention. What? Some pointers from this cave keeps leading me back to this house. But I need more evidence before I can enter. What? Wait, what? What house? Or imagine the killer's like our wife. Or Kevin. Imagine? I'm guessing a lot of people. I'm guessing Tony's still, but that would be crazy if it was... No, there would be no reason. No, 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 no. There would be no reason why it would be our wife. It has to be Tony. Detective, meet oh my me God. in the woods by your house. I need you to hurry over here right now. No! Bro, we're gonna die. Take my gun. Take my Open the door. Take my gun. I need to take my gun. I don't trust this. I don't trust this. I, bro, this guy is telling me to go in the woods. No! I am not... No, I am not doing this. Gosh, guys, we're we're walking into a trap. This is the trap. What if what if, like I don't know if the chief is like Tony too. I don't know if Tony killed the chief. I I'm not sure, but oh my gosh, Saturday three. This is three in the morning. Dog, we're dead. We are dead. At least take a gun with you. Like it, like bro. Well, guys, uh, this was a fun game because I know that our death is upon us. I just want to say, um, I'm sorry that I was a bad person to Linda and Kevin. That was probably the chief. Tony just probably just killed the chief just now. I, I, if I hear screaming like that, I would run the other direction at this point. Oh, I'm not controlling this anymore. Oh my god. Wait, is that Tony? Wait. Wait, this is Tony. Is it? Or is this the chief? Oh my god, I was wrong. Tony! No! And it's the freaking crow killer. 
The Crow Killer's fingerprint could still be on here. I need to take this to the station. Yes, you should. I'm going to find him tonight. Dude. Kill him, kill him, kill him. I mean, bro. This is Tony, isn't it? He's dead. We gotta go. We gotta go back to the station now. Never mind, I was wrong. I, I legit thought Tony was gonna be the killer, actually, this whole time. Let's go, we gotta go now. We gotta find this killer now. We gotta know who is the freaking culprit of this entire crime case that's been going on for about a decade. I need to compare the current evidence files with the fingerprints on the knife. Okay, but where do we go, though? Find the evidence room. Okay, uh, the evidence room isn't around here at all. And again, this is a police department with no one in it. It's just an office that, and it's just a place that anyone can walk inside. Okay, this is the investigation room. No one's in there. The evidence room must be over here. Is this it? Evidence room, yes. The door is locked. There should be a key somewhere in the office. The door is locked. I don't have access to the laboratory key. What's happening? Pick the lock. Wait, what? Hold on. What is this? I did not... They, they're telling me to go to the... To the, um... To the off... Wait. I need to get the evidence files before I begin. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I was confused. I was like, why are they making me do this without me even going to the evidence room? Okay. So our key... Our key should be somewhere in here. Somewhere. There you go. Yep. Evidence room key. Let's go. Let's get out of here. I will say this game is good. This game is pretty good. And the fact that it's free is mind-blowing. This dude got Berlizzi voice acting this game. And dude, this dude is giving the game out for free. Shout out to you, my boy. That's awesome. Oh, snap. Okay. Now, where is the evidence, though, that Carlos found? That's the problem. I don't know where that is. Oh, it's this one for sure. Is this the evidence that Carlos found? Hey! Oh, heck no. Nah. Hey! Hey! Oh, someone's here. Someone's here. Ooh, someone's here. They know. They know that we have the evidence. They know. They freaking know. They know. They're in the police department. They're in here. Okay. Unpack. Place no evidence. Brush fingerprints. Bro, I'm scared. I'm gonna turn around. Knife fingerprints. Fingerprints found by Carlos. They look very different, though. Okay, evaluate. There's two different fingerprints. Carlos either got it wrong, or there's two people involved. So there's two people, yeah, those two, those fingerprints are different, dude. Two different fingerprints. Alright, we're leaving the police station. We're leaving. We're getting out of here. Two people. That is interesting. So the crow killer isn't alone, it's not just one, it's not just one crow killer. It's two crow killers. the house in the woods see at that point i'd be like um sir we got a note here we need some backup uh tour three four five the house in the woods go in the smart move is go in call backup have them ambush if you know you walk in and you see that you're gonna get killed and then boom they can bust in the house and then arrest the guy i need to check the evidence board in my office This is, this is crazy. All right, let's go to my office. Yeah, this whole game we have not went in my office yet. So let's go into the office. 
All right. What do we have here? Inspect what is this? Dead plans. We have not been in this office in a minute. Open. Nothing. Okay, let's inspect. Let's inspect the board. Let's inspect this. This is what the note meant by the house in the woods. Oh, it's that one we had in the dream. I couldn't enter the house a few years ago because I didn't have enough evidence. That doesn't make any sense, though. But now I don't care anymore. Crow, crow. I will find him there. Kill him, kill him, kill him. I'm assuming, does he mean that he can go in the office because the person in there doesn't want you to get in unless there's enough evidence? Is that what it is? That's, that's what I'm guessing, dude. Here we go. Here we go, guys. I think this, this is about where it's about to go down. This obsession has nothing to do with your job anymore. You're doing this in your spare time every single day. I can't take this anymore. I want a divorce. Oh. Ouch. Oh man. The way he commu the way he communicated to her about it is garbage, but what he's not what he's doing is not particularly bad. He just didn't manage good communication and all that stuff, you know, that's what matters, you know. People will be doing these cases and still be married just fine. Oh my goodness. All right, we're about to bust through this door. Enter the house. Get your gun. Do you have a gun? You're not going to you're not about to go into a house in the woods that some random stranger gave you in a note without give without bringing a gun. You better have a gun on you, my guy. All right. And so this room, what's in here? Oh my gosh. Oh my god, there's someone running. There's someone going through the house right now. What's going on? Oh, there's another piece of paper. Let's enter this room first. Turn. What? What does this note say? When I was down, he left me, but I didn't give up. Bro, let me read it. But I didn't give up, even though it was not right. Oh my gosh. Give me this key. Yep. Give me the key. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Open the door. All right, what's in the room? It's a black crow instead. This person meets the description of the original crow killer. He dead? The blood on him is brown and dry. He's been dead before Carlos and Tony were even murdered. There's someone else in this house who was copying the Crow Killer's trademark. Oh, snap. So this was the original Crow Killer and there's someone else. And that's what the Sanger Fring is, the second fingerprint is. So it's not two people, guys. It is not two people. Whoa. Big enough to crawl in. Screwdriver. Alright, that's what we use the screwdriver for. Unscrew. 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 Enter the vent. Oh, man, this is a good story, guys. Like, I didn't, I thought I was uh, solving this case by myself, but I was wrong. Who is the killer? I'm trying to guess. Like, is it the chief? I don't know if it's the chief. Oh! Oh, hex nah. Oh, I did not expect. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my freaking God, bro. What is that screaming? Oh, my gosh. Bro, this guy is trying to stab us right now. What? Bro, who is this killer? I doubt it's my wife. But to be fair, that's not far-fetched now, because this is a new killer that's, like, just copying the new one, the original one's moves. 
It could be anybody. It could be the chief. It could be my son. I I don't know anymore. Oh. Okay. Okay. Well, the killer is in this house. He is in this house with us right now. Bro, what is gonna happen, bro? Jeez, what is gonna happen? Oh my gosh. Who is this? Kill him. What if I don't? I mean, it makes sense to kill him, but I'm just curious to see what happens if I don't. What if I just don't move? Oh, bro. Bro, watch it be our freaking wife and we just shoot our wife, bro. I've been here for like a minute. Nothing's happening. Shoot him! To be fair, though, we didn't know that was him. Wait, suicide by cop? Wait, what? Suicide by cop. Is it Kevin? Oh my god. Is that? to say right now I what have I done guilt oh yeah you're gonna feel nothing oh my gosh guilt is just at the same time though it's not his fault like yeah to be fair though he did bad decisions like really really communicating badly with his wife and just not focusing on his family but his son getting shot is he's not to blame 100 percent like the case has been solved yet i wish i never got involved i killed my only son i became too obsessed with this case I'm resigning. Twenty four hours later. Hey, I just saw your resignation letter. I'm sad to see you go, but I understand after everything that just happened. We're all gonna miss you a lot. Hey, who's we? When you're at the there station, no leave your equipment. Meet me in the interrogation room. I have some questions about what just happened. I'll see you there. Over. Dang, man. That's... That's crazy, bro. Like, what do you even do after that? Like, what do you do? I mean, it doesn't excuse why his son would do that. There's no, there'd be no reason to murder people. I mean, he killed the, the original Crow Killer. But still, dude. 
he got to the point where he felt that abandoned from his dad of attention and stuff that he legit murdered people. Which th th that gives no excuse to kill people, but... I mean... Where's Linda in all this, bro? We need Linda back. So this is the chief, huh? Fine. Alright. I just have a few quick questions for you. You're not the chief. You sound way different. Do you know why your son decided to steal the Crow Killer's trademark, specifically for the killings of Carlos and Tony? He wanted to get my attention. He knew that I would be even more obsessed with the case after he killed my two best friends. So he copied the original Crow Killer's trademark before killing Carlos and Tony to target my interest directly. Do you know what drove him to the point of murder and suicide? Wait, so he shot himself? I didn't shoot him, he shot himself. He hated me because of my obsession with this case, and he had nothing to lose, knowing that I wouldn't hesitate to pull the trigger after everything leading up to that moment. So I did pull it. His way of getting payback before suicide- Did he shoot himself or did I shoot him? I was making sure I felt the guilt of, my kill of killing my own son in the line of duty. And he got what he wanted. I see. Well, that's all I wanted to know. Take care, man. Uh, wow. This is a bad ending. What is this? And we're gonna visit my. And we're gonna visit my son, bruh. Oh, man. Again, he had no reason to kill those people, but. It's just an awful situation. Watch Linda just be in here. Just in this house. Flowers. Who gave us flowers? Who gave us flowers? Oh, we bought- I'm tripping, we bought flowers. For his grave. Alright. Let's go. I'm assuming Linda would be there, right? That's her son, too. There's no way that she wouldn't be there at her- at his- at her son's funeral, also. I'm like- I'm like speechless right now. Alright, let's go. This is such a messed up situation right now. I guess bad. Alright, where is he? Oh, he's gonna be in the middle. Kevin. 18, bruh. 18. He's my age, bro. I love you, son. Linda? Hey there. Linda! I understand. You must feel like complete everything but what happened is not your fault Kevin changed a lot after the divorce he blamed everything on you he became violent very violent but it took me a long time to realize I was in the wrong my frustrations made me forget the main reason why you wanted to solve this case so badly you were trying to protect us to make us feel safe. I regret so many things. I regret not being more understanding. I regret not getting Kevin the help he needed. I regret the divorce. I realize now how lucky I was to have someone that made me feel safe and protected. I took it all for granted. What I'm trying to say is, I understand now. I miss you so much, please. Can we start over again? That's an ending. 
Yes, I would say yes in a heartbeat. Oh my gosh, yes, turn your life around, my boy. Yes. Goofy doctor better hurry up with Linda's ultrasound. Burlazy! Anticipation <laughs> is killing me. You should be here any second now. Oh, you they have a new baby. Like 20 minutes ago. Margaret, shut your mouth. minutes ago, according to my watch. Y'all got watches? I don't even have a second pair of underwear. Okay, Bill, we don't need to know this. This is it's disgusting, a baby. man. Oh my gosh. They're having another baby. We've got the result from Linda Soto Sound. Uh huh. Looks like you're gonna be the father of two little boys. <gasps> oh my god! This time, I was gonna do better as a father. I was gonna be there for them. And I knew from the start that I was gonna name our kids after those two. Tony and Carlos. Yes! Carlos and Tony. Here I thought Tony was the killer, bruh. Oh my gosh. To, live, to have their name live on. Jordan Lindgren, I hope I'm, I'm saying your name right, bro. What a fantastic game, bro. Oh my god, this game was so freaking beautiful, bruh. Bro, this dude, look, this dude, this dude did everything. <laughs> oh my freaking gosh, bro. Wow. Wow. R.I.P. Tony and R.I.P. Carlos. Resting here is a man who found his passion in his work, forever dedicated and fulfilled. I mean, he was kind of lazy still, but I love you, man. Oh, I want to read what Carlos is one says. So this is based on a conversation in New Year's Eve? Really? What conversation is that? Support him on Patreon, guys. Wow, this was a really great game. Subscribe to Jordan's channel, guys. Low key, this is one of the, this is one of the few games where I actually like really enjoyed the story about it. Like I really got hooked on it. Well, guys, that is the story of the final pin. This is an amazing game, guys. If you want to play it for yourself, I'm gonna put a link in the description, bro. Subscribe to his channel. I'm gonna put a link into his channel in the description. You guys are that you guys are awesome for sticking here and watching this game with me. I'm probably I'm definitely gonna put this into one part. I'm not gonna have two parts to this. I'm probably gonna it's gonna take a while for me to edit this, but hey, I'm gonna put it out as fast as possible. Hope you guys enjoy this. Stay golden, my friends. And what an amazing game this was. And thank you for watching with me on this journey. Subscribe, guys. Discord in the description. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, guys. Peace out.